Hi, this is Dina Tollefson. Welcome to my studio. So excited today. We have some new art supplies. 11 by 14 canvas and 24 uh, premium oil colors. My friends from Arteza's. Okay, so let's get these uh, started here. Let's see if we can get these unwrapped. These are the 11, uh, 11 by 14. Get that knife. There we go. Uh, 11 by 14 canvas, stretch canvas, and let's get, uh, gonna get these, set one down here. Let's get these up on the easel. It looks like they have a stapled back. Um, I typically use a splined back on my, and they're pretty on the, kind of on the thin side, um, but we've got now, we, oh, we've got our colors here, our 24 oil colors, so open up the box. Um, I was saying that I took okay, so let's pull these out of the can. There we go. Set these out here. Oh, set the box down. Now it looks like the uh, I was expecting them to be a little bit bigger. They're not super big, but that's okay. Let's see. Looks like the bonus is that there are quite a few of them, so that's good. Each canvas is toned. And uh, seeing that this canvas is taking the color well, it's not quite as um, thick as I normally would do, but the canvas seems to be holding very well and taking the color well in this acrylic that I'm putting on. So that's good. Okay, so, so far so good. All right, so let's now look at these little little tubes. What do we got here? All right. Oh, yep, yellow ochre. Love that. That's one of my favorite colors. Okay, very good. Now let's squeeze one of these out. This is the this is the cerulean blue. Let us on the palette. Ah, very nice. Beautiful color. Looks like it's a nice thick. Uh, thick, good for my imposter to make that going to be good. All right, so I've got uh, some of this, the green. This is the light green. We've got the Prussian blue, very dark. Um, the yellow, the um, this cobalt violet, sky blue, beautiful sky blue. Can make a great painting with that. I'm noticing that the um, colors didn't necessarily match up uh, perfectly with was on the label, but that's fine. Let's do a little test here and mix. I'm going to add a little of the black to this yellow and get this mixed up. It's making a beautiful green. Let's try a, a little bit of our white. Get that going. A little bit of the... Uh, is that one? That's the... Uh, I think that was the orange, yes, and get that mixed in. Okay, that's mixing beautifully. I noticed that the white, the titanium white, isn't necessarily um, the titanium white. And um, let's see here, let's add a little bit of, let's get a little of that uh, ultramarine blue. Okay, and back some more titanium white. There we go, get that mixed in. Um, let's see if we can make a nice neutral here. That's pretty, that's a pretty color. Okay, that's very nice. It's. Uh, let me get over to the canvas. And I'm... Um, Working here and making an underpainting with my technique. And I'm going to get this just in there with the brush. Very nice. Okay. And just curve that around. All right, so we've got an underpainting. Yes. Okay. So. Here are the colors. I've mixed up some different colors from my underpainting. Here comes the test. 
All right, you ready? Let's get our first daub on. There we go. Okay. All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, so let's go with a little bit of this kind of gentle green, light yellowy green mixed up and test that out. Seems to be going very well on the canvas, very smooth. The colors seem to be nice and um, thick, good for the impasto technique. I'd say the only negative I can think of is that the containers are really tiny. I use so much paint in my technique that it would be nice to have giantly large containers, but I think it's really great for a small painting like this. You know, the canvas seam that gets thick enough. Um, I think it's okay. All right. And now let me add my final touches on here. Um, we'll get a little bit of this kind of gray blue going. There we go. So my overall impression of this Arteza paint and the canvas is very positive, especially for small works. Um, now the, if you're planning to uh, frame your work, these thin canvases are actually a uh, benefit um, as opposed to if you're trying to frame like a really thicker canvas it's uh, you're kind of more limited in what frames you're using but I'm uh, yeah very impressed with this um, all right very good all right so now it's your turn and uh, I want to thank you so much for joining me here in the studio thank you to my friends at Arteza for the gift of this canvas and the paint in exchange for an honest review and I uh, hope that you come back again and see me again in the studio. Until next time, this is Dina Tollefson. Bye-bye.